Hi everyone, my name is Faisal Ahmed. <coughs> I'm an international student at ELC in Old Dominion University. I'm gonna present today study skills. I'm gonna start my introduction by two questions. The first question, what are study skills? According answers that ask.com study skills are that you will learn to help you. Another definition, the way how to study to pass. Some example of a good study skills, study every day in same times. Another question, why are study skills important? <clears throat> They will help the student to learn and remember new information. They will help the student to do the homework assignment quizzes and tests. They can help the student to pass to next grade. Because, <coughs> because Without know how to study, that will that will affect the student. Maybe the student will fail. I define I defined my uh, presentation to five important points. The first important points: things to need to study. You need before a study prepare your brain first and your material. For example, your book, your notebook, your pen, your pencil, and your resource. <clears throat> I'm gonna start with prepare your your brain. If you if you want to study, you cannot think about a lot of things in your life. You must only concentrate about the material, about what what you will do. For example, if you want to study for math, you must be prepare your your pen and your notebook and and do a lot of exercise to remember the math. <clears throat> the second important things uh, where you can where can you study? Before, before, before start to study, you can you can search about good place to study. For example, the library. The library at Odio it's open all the week, twenty four hours, and you can bring your material, go there to study. There are quiet area. No noisy and uh, talking allowed, not allowed, and also the music or something not allowed. You must be use your headphone. And also, you can study at home alone if you can. That's make that's make make you give like full concentrate. The third, second important things to study how do you manage your time I think this point is very very important first of all you must read carefully the syllabus you take it from the from the teacher or instructors or the professor in the beginning of the semester or the sessions that 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 you will help you fully to that you will help you fully to to organize your time and and manage the and manage your time for example if you take the syllabus you can know when when you get when you will take the quizzes or the test or the assignment and that will make will help you fully in to do the assignment or the homework 
also you can also you can write down from the if the teacher not give you the assignment or the quizzes uh, in the beginning or in the syllabus and you can write down the paper and you manage your time to to study and also to have fun also you must write down when the due date to take the test or the project because there are deadline you cannot uh, you are not allowed to give the the project or the test or the homework after that days and also you must decide how much time you spend at school <coughs> at the school and spend double that time to study at home or at library for example if you are spent four hours to study at school you must spend eight hours to study at home that will make you pass and understand the materials also you cannot leave the test until last moment or last an hour to try to understand and get an A for that test, that test. you must be study from the first day start the class the fourth important the fourth important point is how to how to deal with the stress <coughs> stress stress maybe will affect the student because that's because if you are spend a lot of time to study and you you are have like a headache or a stress that will make you spend your time without any benefit you must for all the student clean they brain and don't think about anything uh, out of the book or the class you must be think in the material how what is your study you cannot study you cannot study when you are uh, feel sleepy or you are uh, feel hungry you must be only concentrate in the book The fifth important point strategy the student must organize himself for example if you are a study to in English you must be study alone and you must be try to memorize the the rules or the grammars or how to write for example if you are if you are if you are won't do any say you must be sitting alone and and try to try to concentrate about what did you write about it and uh, another things another strategies uh, you must be you must be if you can't study with group like if you want study for math you must be study with group maybe that will help you because if you will if you are don't understand you can ask my fr your friend to explain about the exercise and you must be repeat the exercise four or five times to understand the way how how <coughs> how can answer And I have this website to help the student about find the strategy and about all five points and this websites the website is 
student.net studentguide.net here you can help you about learning study and also time management reading research writing you can ha this website can help the student to to understand what you will do in the semester like like they uh, it can give you like an advice for example here learning studying they they will give you about uh, strategy how to study also I like the, this website because they are multi-language for example Arabic and Turkey I wish everyone understand my presentation and take the opportunity from the study skills and uh, I have thanks a lot for Miss Ashley Green to give me another chance to do my presentation because yesterday uh, last week I was so busy with my wife in the hospital thank you for listening and have a great evening